Welcome to the 2013 Kids ATV Shootout. Let's check out the Honda. The Honda TRX-90X is the elder statesman of the youth ATV market. Over the years, Honda has done a great job of creating a machine that suits a wide variety of riders, thanks to its semi-automatic transmission. Unlike the CVT-equipped competition, the TRX has a four-speed transmission that doesn't require the use of a clutch. Since not all of our riders were experienced, we stuck the TRX in second or third gear and let the kids ride. When the kids don't know how to shift, this also acts as a limiter on how fast the top speed is. It actually serves as a good training tool in this regard. The biggest problem with the TRX-90X is that it's cold-blooded. It takes a good 10 to 15 minutes before you can ride it without stalling, and another 10 to 15 minutes of riding beyond that before you can take the choke off. This isn't unique to just our test unit either. We own a couple of them, and they all exhibit this trait. Once you get past that hiccup, there's not much to complain about, though. This is the quad that I ride at home. It's a Honda, and I like it because it's really fast. The Honda makes good power, and once your kids are familiar with shifting, they will have the ability to climb any hill, win any hole shot, and generally get a leg up on riders who cut their teeth on the CVT bikes. The Honda is also the biggest of these three, although only by a bit. The seat height is taller in particular, so it's better suited for bigger kids. It also has drum brakes on front and rear, so it was never really affected by mud buildup. This is an important feature for parents who live in wet climates. Although the parents like what they see from the TRX styling, it was rated second best in the looks department by our kids. It closely resembles the full-size TRX models, and it offers decent protection from water and mud. It's the only ATV in the test that has actual foot pegs, too. When it's all said and done, the Honda TRX-90X is probably most well-suited for a bigger kid who can't understand the concept of shifting right away. It is the most expensive ATV in the test by $300, too. But again, it's a little more advanced than the other two youth ATVs here. If you're looking to buy a bike that will suit a young rider for a long time, then you'll like what the Honda TRX-90X has to offer. <laughs>